Wow, guys. I saw an absolutely beautiful sunrise this morning. It's still going on, but it's not as brilliant as it was. But it is awesome. Here's a view. Now I wanted to talk about cabbage. Four months ago we planted cabbage and uh, we planted it outdoors and then we dug it up when it was looking like it was going to frost and we planted it inside and we have uh, been keeping track of it. It has grown a lot as you can see but it has never formed a head and there are I, I you know I asked Jessica about it and she said well maybe it's some kind of cabbage that doesn't form a head maybe it's just some kind of leaf cabbage well I looked online and started investigating and I found that there's about five reasons why a cabbage uh, might not form a head. Let me get those out for you and we'll go through them. I got my handy dandy phone here. Okay, the first reason is maybe it hasn't been long enough. It says a cabbage can form heads even, you know, between 70 and 100 days. Well, four months is 120 days so um, since it was first planted in September anyway you know you might be able to give it another week or so or whatever because you transplanted it had to go through a little bit of adjustment period or you know something like that but Basically, it's been 120 days. Um, the second reason is maybe it's too close to other cabbages or other plants, and so it's feeling crowded. Um, my cabbage in the grow room is pretty close to other plants, so that's a possibility of why it has not formed a head. Um, another possibility is excess nitrogen. I have not checked my nitrogen uh, ratio to see if it's like a huge ratio of nitrogen compared to the potassium and phosphorus, but um, I will be looking at that and we will investigate that and see if we can uh, adjust that if necessary. Uh, the fourth reason is heat or cold. Now, in my basement, there's not any extreme temperatures. It's pretty much, you know, between 55 and 65 all year round. You know, it might get a little bit warmer in the summertime. If it's 100 degrees out, I'm sure it'll be getting up to 70 or something in there but it's the basement it's not uh, outdoors and the last reason is early damage by cutworms and we do not have any uh, insects inside or <laughs> whatever they may be called pests inside especially in January um, the worst thing that we have gotten inside in January is stink bugs. And I've never seen any of those downstairs. So, those are five things for you guys if you're having problems with your cabbage forming a head. Like this video if you like it. Don't forget to subscribe and hit that notification bell for more videos from this channel. And uh, we're also on Facebook, 
Pinterest, Twitter, Instagram, and LinkedIn. Don't forget to check out our TubeBuddy link below. There are also some other links if you like some of the stuff that we've done in the past. Anyway, that's my two cents for the day. Thanks for watching. God bless, and see you next time.